Friday, time to unwind, right? Getting closer to dinner time here. And if you loaded up on groceries for the weekend, you probably noticed your bill was a tad bit higher. And every penny counts these days. 10 Tampa Bay's Candace Avila has checked into what's behind the supermarket price hike. Whether it's eggs or meat, the cost of nearly every food continues to rise. According to the Bureau of Economic Analysis, over the past two years, beef and veal saw the biggest spike at 20.2%, eggs 10.4%, poultry 8.6%, and dairy at 7%. So why is this happening? We know back in March, the coronavirus pandemic interrupted grocery store supply chains, causing prices to go up. Something as simple as egg companies not having the correct cartons to package their eggs. Also in April, the coronavirus sickened thousands of workers at meat processing plants, putting another strain on the meat industry. But that was six months ago. Why are we still seeing food prices continue to go up every month? What we're starting to see happen is grocery store supply chains slowly starting to go back to normal, but food pricing is not. Agribusiness experts hypothesize with little pushback from consumers on rising prices, there's no motivation to stop. And companies are trying to recover some of the losses from earlier in the year by keeping prices up. We reached out to Publix, Kroger, Whole Foods, Trader Joe's, and Aldi's, asking about the recent spikes, and we're still waiting to hear back. As unemployment numbers in America continue to rise, remember, millions of Americans just lost the $600 weekly federal unemployment benefits, putting even more strain on their personal finances. Which then begs the question, as food prices continue to rise month after month, when will it stop? Let's hope it stops soon, but grocery prices seem to be going up even further. The USDA predicts pork prices will rise by 4.5%, poultry 3%, fish and seafood 2%, beef prices, they're the biggest, 8%. You know, beef is a $67 billion industry. But since the COVID-19 outbreak, sales of fresh meat alternatives, they have more than doubled from a year ago.